Welcome to Allergic Stadium, home of the Lost Wages Invaders. And Briggs, last time I was here, I lost my shirt at the casino. Oh, that ain't bad. I lost three fingers of my one good toe. I should have seen it coming, though, Grim. I was in the whole five Gs, and uh, the loan shark was a real shark. Yeah, well, that's a tough break. That was my favorite shirt, too. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Philadelphia Eagles go up against the Lost Wages Invaders. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, well, that's good. But I flunked my model. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. This defender is not going to be stopped. Once he picked up that loose ball, he was going to score or die trying. Luckily for him, he scores! <laughs> <laughs> The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, the defender almost picked us a ball on that one. Third and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. The runner pulls out a chance. <laughs> the football first down <laughs> and it's first and ten First and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. He zings it in there for a four yard gain. Four. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks. 
picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps up sides. He was still talking. He'd be saying, Psycho killer Keska say. What the fuck, 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 fuck? And it's first and ten. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. And that'll bring up third down and inches. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down as guy did a speed feed grip. He's running from his team. And here comes the extra point attempt. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> when you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Not one. with the brain scrambler. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. And it breaks away. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than. Oh, nice hit! Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. Hot. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. He's rumbling and stumbling. Well, he won't be waking up anytime soon. And if he does. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> the defender says, I don't think so. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. <laughs> and 
And it's first and ten. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Oh, the defender just knocked the ball loose. Well, that'll wake you up, then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Uh, unless you're in a sleeping contest. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Welcome to the Great Rage. How can I help you? I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, you just throw it to the guy in the same color jersey as you. You got it? Oh. And he's off to the races. They're getting on him. Hey, come on. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. First and ten. Oh, the defense must have called a hot potato dirty trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping contest. And it's first and ten. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And it's first and ten. And with another pick to kill. Oh, with a brutal hit. Hey, yeah, uh, Briggs, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. First and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> and it's first and ten. to his teammate. We're talking street ball here, Brent. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> Second down and two. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, with the brain scrambler. First and ten. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any... His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. <laughs> and it's first and ten. went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore win. Second down and long. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot two. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. He's not going down. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. No, I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. He could go all the The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, big catch, big run, big touchdown. Yeah, big deal. Missed a meat for Braves man, but the ball didn't fall out. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Man, what a hit that was. <laughs> And 
And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. You've got to catch that. Third down and the punter is warming up. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. I'm going in circles. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. Second down and a lot. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The defense is ready. You can't keep a good meal. No doubt about it. That guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. That's a four-yard gain. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second down and six. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize us, too. Hey, don't give these reps any ideas, you idiot. Grim, I just dash. On it. And this is a first and and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. And the quarterback. Ah, oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Hot two. Hot three. And that's how you shut the monkey. Thunderclap. And he held on to that one for a first down. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense called play. A brutal head-on collision. Not only does... 
he dropped the ball, but someone's going to be taking a long nap after that hit. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. He refuses to go down. And it's first and ten. And that's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. And I'm two fists into this bottle of scotch. The offense is down to their last two linemen. Once they're gone, it's game over. Yeah, who cares? Linemen suck. They don't even deliver any fantasy points. And they spend two years in the league and then they become bouncers at biker bars. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? Third quarter, we are all tied up and set to kick off the second half. Uh, speaking of all tied up, Grim, how many of them elephant laughs in a pill did I take? Uh, I feel like I'm sitting on Mount Vesuvio right now. Oh, one false move, and I'm gonna blow! See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Boom! <laughs> and it's first and ten. play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot of balls, Grim. Second down in a very lot. Perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and long. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Oh, with the brain scrambler. First and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick and it keeps on ticking. 
second down in a lot. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and Week tonight. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. In that call, oh, his head just exploded. <laughs> They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. There's a lot of pressure on you when you ref in the NFL. You go through three interviews and they measure you up and down to see if you're a perfect fit. Yeah, for a casket. First down and forever. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Second down, and we've got a pick. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personality. This guy could talk before he died. What do you think he'd be saying, Briggs? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck? The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the funeral expenses, that is. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to. Oh, what a hit. Hey, Bricks, what does it feel like to get hit like that? Uh, like being dropped off a 10 story building with a refrigerator strapped to your back and landing on a fire hydrant. Yeah, great analogy. Oh, no, no, that really happened. 
happened? Cod game got a little out of hand last night. You can't have fun. Does the QB know what's team? Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. Look. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. My will. And that is unfortunate. You understand me? And it's first and ten. This guy's a brick shooter. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. Look at that little mutant run. Ah. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. The 20. He's at the 10. Touchdown! He takes it to the house on the kickoff return and scores. Man, what a play. just ended up in a meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My God, I know it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Here comes the defense. 
Lance. He's at the 20. Oh, good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah. I... The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Eight. And here's another pick. Man, the boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. We're tied up at the end of the third quarter. You can smell the excitement on the fans. I mean, literally, it is ripe in here. Man. Junior, was that you? Hey, follow me. Second down and long. At this rate, the QB's can touchdown! Why didn't the skeleton dance at the rock club, Grim? Yeah, I don't know. He had no body to dance with. <laughs> That's a pretty good one. The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than... Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Yeah. 
Second down in a very lot. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. And he finds open space. Is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> the quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. I do. I... And another interception. This quarterback, and like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. <laughs> now, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The 20. The 10. And he recovers the fumble and runs it back for a defensive score. That's a backbreaker for the offense. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They had the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stumping time. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. Hot two. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was Brass Knuckles. Bam! 
Martin, say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. It's a touchdown! I would have thought you had to have muscles to move like that. Or a brain or a nervous system, but I see your point, Bricks. The offense lost their last quarterback. Next time their offense comes out on the field, they will have to forfeit the game. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The Los Wages Invaders send the opposition to the Braves and win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stands are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every up.